it's uh, Catherine with Mumtog Educate. Um, I'm just popping on here just as a reminder that this evening at 5 o'clock p.m. my time, there is going to be the very first live for day one of the boot camp. I am going to be editing four different images that I have um, already posted a link to in the main um, feed. So if you log on to just the Mumtug Educate group, you'll just see the post that I've created and it's got a Microsoft document that you can click on. It's going to show the images that we're going to be editing at five o'clock and it's also got the download link attached in that document. Also, it just explains to you which tools I'm going to be using for the editing bootcamp this evening and I understand that not everyone is going to have the same tools and that's okay. Um, if you don't have the same tools, just watch me as I edit. However, it would be great if you could edit along with me because that's the whole purpose of um, this boot camp is so that you can gain confidence in your editing skills. Things are really going to sink in with you um, as you're following along and editing. So one recommendation that I would have is to have your phone open next to the computer so that you can type any questions that you may have during the um, boot camp, as well as follow along on your computer. Um, if you don't have the same tools that I'm using, then use the tools that you do have so that you can at least try and produce something that you would in your own galleries. Um, hi, Jasmine. Danielle, um, hi, Danielle. There's no um, investment at all to join Carrie Lynn. Um, this bootcamp is completely free. I'm just doing this so that um, beginners or people that are struggling with their editing can maybe gain some confidence going forward. And this bootcamp is five days. It's only one hour a day. Um, but as you can read in the um, Microsoft Word document that I've attached in the main feed, um, it explains that you do need to complete the homework assignments in order to um, qualify for any giveaways that I have. Hi, Jessica. So this is a really cool, um, oh my goodness, I say um like a million times. Now you guys are going to hear it every time I say it. I'm trying not to say it. It's my word whisker. Oh, I just about said it again. Okay, so, <laughs> aw, thank you, Carrie Lynn. Uh, I just know that it was really, really hard when I first started, and I really want new photographers and beginner photographers or photographers that maybe just don't love their editing techniques or wonder why their techniques or their editing doesn't look the same as others. Um, this is just a great opportunity for you guys to be able to participate. Uh, it's also going to show you what raw images do look like um, versus always just seeing finished products online. I did find that I couldn't comprehend when I first started out how an image became the end result from what the raw image looked like. So this is also going to show you how to tackle, like if you look at the Microsoft document that I've um, already posted, you're going to be able to see that some of the images are jaundice, like the baby's skin tones are jaundice. So um, it's going to be really great for you guys to follow along with me as I work with uh, these images. And honestly, every skin tone that you're going to encounter when you're doing newborn photography is going to be different. So although you're using the same uh, lighting and the same camera and the same lens, you're going to find that every baby's different when you're editing. So I'm just hoping that I can help you guys uh, tackle these different scenarios confidently and produce images that you really love. And you know, if you're not in the position to um, get any of these different actions or presets, that's okay. Just follow along in the bootcamp, participate as much as you can. And um, the homework assignments that are going to be posted, they're not gonna be posted until the end of the first live. Okay, so every single day I am going to post the images I'm going to be working on during the morning or afternoon or whatever time zone you're in. 
and you guys are going to be able to download those images and then at 5 p.m mountain standard time which is my time zone um, i'm going to be editing those images now there's going to be three or four or five images that i'm going to be working on for each live and after each image that i'm going to work on i am going to stop for a minute and ask you guys if you have any questions just so that i can tackle any of those questions i'm also going to have my sister reading those questions to me while i'm editing so you guys can feel free to comment and um, you know ask questions and engage with me while i'm editing so that if there's something that pops into your head feel free to ask me right there and then and i'll do my best to answer those questions now um i do work on raw files i don't work on jpegs so the images that i am giving you guys to work on are raw so you are going to need to either have adobe camera raw or lightroom to open those images and um i do recommend that if you're not up to date with your software um, make sure you update everything because that is also key into having all of your software function properly um okay i'm hoping that i am on track for everything um reminding also i just wanted to remind you guys too that i am going to have some super awesome giveaways this week there's going to be a super cool scholarship that i will get into more detail throughout the week uh, with but the person who engages the most is most likely going to win that scholarship so that means engaging throughout every single live um, participating in every single homework assignment and commenting the most um, all of it like participation is key you guys um, don't forget that if you do live on the other side of the world i do ask that because you can't engage live that you contact me privately or jasmine um, because i want to be able to know that you're just you know it's the middle of the night for you so of course you can't engage live so i totally understand that and i do want to know that you would otherwise be engaging live so contact me privately i've had several already contact me and reach out so that's really great and i know that there's a lot of you guys that are professional photographers that have been doing this for years and you're very confident and happy with your editing and that's fantastic and i'm happy for you um, but this is you know we can always learn from each other so if there's something that i do differently that um, maybe you can learn something or maybe you'll like it it's great anyways just to to hang out and participate and honestly the community is so wonderful to be a part of this group is has grown tremendously and i just love every single person that has joined and um yeah i'm just i'm really excited for this boot camp so uh check out that uh, microsoft document that i've attached in the group i did it like five minutes ago and uh, if you have any questions, reach out. Uh, also, you can ask Jasmine if you have any questions. She's also here, Jasmine Henry. And uh, if she contacts you, um, check your also check your um, uh, message request in Facebook Messenger because um, certain messages might get hidden or disappear. So um, yeah, I just hope I don't say um 50,000 times. I'm really working on it. I'm really trying not to say it too much. <laughs> So I can't wait. I will be back on in a few hours just to remind you guys about the boot camp. I know that with the new algorithm, I'm not showing up in most people's feeds, even if the notifications are turned on. I don't know what is up with the algorithm. So make sure that you guys are setting some alarms on your phones or devices because for whatever reason, uh, the notifications aren't always showing up. So spread the word too if you guys have any friends that you think um, might enjoy this or learn something and I can't wait to get started. So I will see you guys back in a few hours. You're welcome. Okay, I'll see you guys in a few hours.